excited here at Star of the Valley Church in Oakmont. Today uh, is gonna mark St. Bona of Pisa feast day. We're gonna honor her feast, the patron of pilgrims and travelers, St. Bona of Pisa, and patron of flight attendants. Uh, so here at Star of the Valley, we'll begin with eight o'clock mass. We'll have a blessing of the pilgrims, and then our pilgrims will get on our way, and we'll head over Anna del Trioni State Park uh, with, a, with a pause up top of uh, the lake there, and we'll come down the other side into the east side of Santa Rosa. And this technically will be stage two of what's called the Camino de Sonoma. Santiago in Spain, the symbol is a, a clamshell. The walk goes all the way across Spain, ends up at Compostelo St. James there in, in, in Spain near the ocean and the tradition is you collect a shell on the ocean as a symbol. In all the iconography of St. James, he's always holding a shell and many people as they walk along the way have a shell on their backpack, the patches are a shell and so it's very, very common to see the shell all the way along the, the Compostela de Santiago, the Camino de Santiago and so it's a beautiful memory and today we're celebrating the feast day of Saint Bona Pisa who is a patron saint of, of pilgrimages and so in her pictures frequently she's holding a shell as well. It's a great symbol for us because of course in most many baptisms we use a shell to pour the water over the the person's head so it's a great symbol for us to remember. The walk today inspired by the spirit they will walk to bring healing to themselves our communities and our world they will walk a healing path for a world that is hurting in so, so many ways, especially over the last few days. So we wish you well on your walk. Don't get lost. <laughs> if you do, call me up. <laughs> 539. Send your spirit upon all of us, and especially on the walkers today. May they be touched by your spirit and grow in their love of Christ and one another. And may each step they take be a healing step for a world that is de definitely in need of much, much healing. In the name of the Lord, we ask this blessing and we bless you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 Go in peace. Thanks. Have Thanks. a good walk. And again, my phone number. <laughs> 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 doing this uh, but it's very simple I can break it down for you very simply we do this as a walk of healing we heal eastern and western divisions of churches uh, people that walk pilgrims that walk find a healing for themselves in the walking in the traveling and we do this to understand those that have walked before us and the healing that needs to happen between us and our present day and the indigenous people that walked before us along those 75 miles so the Camino de Sonoma healing divisions between Eastern and Western for ourselves and our indigenous people and all our relationships here in this world, our divisive world. Uh, the community of Sonoma starting in Sonoma, ending in Fort Ross. Uh, hope you join us one of these uh, many days that we're guiding tours there.